Okay. Boop ba boop. All right. Are you guys ready for this shit? I guess. <laughs> Man, Billy's still tying his shoe. So excited, Dave. You know, you're like, so really? excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> All right. So, How you doing, Jesse? I will do the thing. Shazam! All right, so. Um, last. Movie star and Shaquille O'Neal. What's that? Oh no, <laughs> that was and... that was Kazam. Uh, uh, <laughs> that, like Berenstein Bears. Uh, yeah. Thing that people keep trying to say. <laughs> well, Shaquille O'Neal was the real one. They keep saying it's uh, Sinbad was in a genie movie, and he was not. <laughs> but. Anyway, <laughs> the character Sinbad has been in many genie movies. Yeah, but yeah, that doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> but the actor. Maybe that's that's where everyone's getting confused. Um, but anyway, quick recap of last session. Uh, previously on Les Wizards, <laughs> our heroes again met with Lady Rose. After some quick negotiations, uh, they agreed to work as adventurers on retainer. Standing by to deal with any problems their skill sets might prove useful in dealing with. Things are quiet after your arrival, however, so you were able to spend the next two weeks or so getting settled into your new homes. Uh, you had some time to uh, meet with and interact with a few of the other denizens of Castle Rose and get some background on a few things going on behind the scenes, uh, such as uh, Jorik's uh, attempt on Lady Rose's life before she decided to hire him. Um, and his fetishes. What? No, we didn't. We didn't do that. He liked eating. He liked eating saliva from other people. I. Oh, right. <laughs> God damn it! Had to make it weird. Okay. Definitely did that. Um. But yeah, so I guess Otterts, um, you were you were absent last session. Um, so the only thing I need to catch you up on is um, what are you doing for your two weeks of downtime? So I think the two weeks of downtime was probably spent with Otter Cup, getting her like a little farmhouse set up and making <laughs> sure she was all situated. Yeah. Uh, You're not just going to leave your wife in the barracks while you go off on adventures? No, yeah. <laughs> he's, he's, he's are you, a, get, are you uh, getting her pregnant ahead of time so that when you come back, you don't have to wonder? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure they're trying. <laughs> Oh. Hey, this one's got opposable thumbs. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, so yeah, you're you're spending most of the two weeks just sort of like getting people to to help like start building a a proper domicile, if you will, on your new land. Mm -hmm. Um. And um. Yeah, like a few days into it, uh, a messenger comes for you comes to uh looking for you and uh they inform you that uh lady rose wishes to meet with with you in private to discuss a few things okay well definitely go all right so you head up to the castle and uh hire an otter to find your beaver <laughs> god damn it <laughs> <laughs> So you you, uh, you meet with her, she, you know, it's not the usual throne room deal. They actually let you in the, you know, her, her private chambers. Um, and she's just very casually like, oh, hey, Otterts. Um, <laughs> stop it, Moroku. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so Otterts, I, I, uh, Captain Voslov was telling me that she thinks you, you might be a sorcerer. Is, is that true? Ah, indeed it is. Huh, interesting. She's like, I too am a sorcerer. Uh, where, where did your, um, do you know anything about your bloodline? Like, where does your, where does your magic come from? Ah, rumor is that one of my ancestors had some form of relation with an ancient kraken. Not sure if that's true, but that's, you know, at least the story. <laughs> she gives you kind of a weird look, but nods like, oh, okay, that's... 
that's strange. Uh, apparently, I have some sort of either silver or white dragon in, in my background. Um, but it, I, I assume it goes way, way back. Um, but yeah, I just, you know, wanted to, to talk shop about, you know, sorcery stuff. Where sorcerers are so rare these days, you know? Um, mm. Yeah. And she just kind of, like, keeps asking, like, like just questions about like you know what is your what can your magic do like what what your abilities are and you know how how long have you had it and and this that and the other thing and um you know she she kind of like offhandedly mentions that her her own um when she first realized she was a sorcerer uh, she was uh she was a child and she pretty much threw a temper tantrum and like froze all of the water within like uh like a couple hundred feet of her. <laughs> uh, I think Otter tells the story of, you know, his first time he was, uh, you know, <clears throat> on a boat, like the fishing family boat. <clears throat> and uh, he was, you know, just playing around with the other kids that were on the boat and juggling. And at one point he's, you know, like got distracted, but he was still juggling. <laughs> <laughs> the, the things you were juggling were just like still floating or... Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. He turned away, but the balls never stopped. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so she just kind of chats with you for a while, just very, like, low-key, like, you know, talking sorcerer shop, and eventually she's like, yeah, hey, I, I have to get back to, you know, some stuff, but it was great talking to you, and, and it's great to, to have you here. Um, you know, let me let me know if you have any issues getting your with your land or anything. I'll uh I'll make sure things are, are situated for you. And uh Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think Otterix expresses, you know, like the same thing, like, oh it's you know, lovely to talk to another sorcerer. Um, you know, anytime you, you wanna chat, I you know, I'm around. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, sorry, I got my windows all screwed up here. There we go. Okay. Um, but yeah, like that's that's pretty much it. Um, you know, you go back, you spend the rest of your time just kind of getting your stuff in order. And, you know, at the end of two weeks, you at least have something better than a tent on your land that your wife can stay in. Uh. <laughs> got, you know, some seeds going. What, what time of year is it? Oh, it's uh, it's like late spring. Okay, so yeah, we probably have her like set up with a, you know, a garden. Yeah. And then, um, get get a get a start on that that summer harvest. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. So then and then yeah, you you Zach, you kind of got the cliff notes on everyone else's stuff uh, from courtesy of Dave. Yeah, I'm not okay. totally sure I remember all of it, but I okay. did read them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Somewhere. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Dave. <laughs> um, so yeah, you guys are, are doing your downtime. Um, just nothing really going on for for the next couple of weeks. A lot, a uh, few more caravans of people come into the into the city. Um, but other than that, things are, are kind of quiet. Um, but eventually, uh, Lady Rose uh, reaches out to you all, uh, calls you into the the castle to meet with her to discuss a job. Um, and you guys are brought into, uh, you're not doing the throne room stuff this time. It's, it's kind of like less official at this point. So you're getting like the, um, what is it? You're making use of your, your command center upgrade there. <laughs> the, the war room, if you will, you guys are brought into the war room. Um, and, um, Five yeah. folding tables and a five folding chairs and a and a poker table. <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, there's like a table with like a map on it and like the surrounding lands and stuff. Not nothing, nothing super fancy yet. Um, but yeah, Lady Rose, uh, Lady Rose is there as well as uh, Captain Vozlov and a few other folks you've you've seen around at this point. Um. Lady Rose tells you, um, yeah, we've, uh, 
we've been having some issues with a um, with a tribe of uh, agamids in the mountains attacking uh, supply caravans, and it's kind of a big deal right now because uh, trade is sort of how we're surviving. Um, we actually aren't producing enough food to feed people yet. Uh, <laughs> Mm. <laughs> What's that, Dave? <laughs> What's what? You you draw Pac-Man on the map there. I didn't draw that. Oh. <laughs> well, you're green. <laughs> Stop that. <laughs> Guys, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> no Pac-Man here. Come on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least it's not dicks, you know? Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Well, why'd you have to throw that out? Well, because it was dicks once upon a time. Yeah. Yep. Well, I'm just now you're just putting that idea out there, though. That's all I'm saying. Uh, don't make me turn <laughs> off drawings. I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> you start drawing dicks, you lose your drawing privileges. That, I'm just throwing that out there now. <laughs> all right? But, uh... <laughs> but, yeah, so... Lady Rose is explaining to you guys the whole issue with, you know, they don't, they're not really going to have enough food to feed people if they don't have trade coming in. Um, so the caravans getting attacked is uh, pretty bad right now. Um, and so basically, she wants to send you guys up to track down the Agamids. Um, ideally, try to negotiate some sort of agreement with them. Uh, if that becomes untenable, make them not a problem anymore um and uh yeah she's gonna send um uh captain Voslov along with you guys um to sort of act as an emissary um she's also a skilled tracker so if you guys are having any issues with tracking she can help you out um and yeah that's pretty much your job right now so uh what are you guys doing? Negotiate for more pay. <laughs> <laughs> Very heroic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, wh where Try. are the agamids located? Um, well, they're we're, we don't exactly know. They're we know they're local. They're, I think, up in the mountains, coming out of the mountains and attacking uh, trade caravans. Uh, while they're mm -hmm. on the road. Are they? Killing those they cross, or are they just like you know sacking, like ransacking them, and then heading back off into the wilderness? Uh, pretty much just ransacking and heading back into the wilderness. Maybe be bargained with then. Yeah. Do you guys want to set up a fake caravan, or do you want to just go hiking through <laughs> the mountains? Um. Well, Captain Voslov suggests that. Uh, you guys start by uh, traveling to the site of the latest attack and seeing if you can find anything there. Um, but, you know, right, you're right. sort of leading the operation, so it's mm -hmm. up to what you guys want to do. Mm -hmm. This is our first performance review. Yeah, <laughs> kind of. <laughs> um, when's the next caravan scheduled? Uh, they're not really on a schedule. They're coming and going, like, pretty much all the time. Is there one coming out of town soon? Coming through that area? Uh, I, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. Rest of the party, do you guys want to just go investigate the area, or? Well, um, yeah, I mean, I mean it's a good starting point. So Sykes, uh, last session you mentioned you were like looking into the different tribes and stuff as well, right? Yeah, I wanted to get more info on that. Okay, so you make a common knowledge roll if you want, um, and I'll give you like plus one on that since it's like your racial stuff. Yeah. All right. Um, so yeah, you know there's a um, there's a local tribe of uh, the Stormborn uh, Agamids. Uh, up in the mountains, they call themselves the uh, Vrugal Strun, which roughly translates to common as fighters of Strun. Um, and yeah, just like attacking caravans and stuff seems like their usual MO. Okay, good to know. 
Um, but yeah, you know, they could they could probably be bargained with one way or another. Right. They're called frugal. <laughs> no, vrugal. Oh. <laughs> yeah, like a pastry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I assume the captain knows the limits of what we can offer. Yeah, yeah, that's that's kind of the other reason she's going with you. She she's like being given authority to speak on behalf of of Lady Rose. Yeah. Okay. Um, if caravans are coming and going pretty frequently, are only food shipments being hit, or are other types being hit too? Uh, it seems like kind of a mix, but um, the food shipments are the ones we need to not be losing out of everything. Yeah. <laughs> I understand the importance, but I was like, oh, are they yeah. going only after the food, or are they going after everything but hitting food? No, it, it doesn't seem uh, very targeted. Okay. Making sure there's no, like, subtext of, like, they're having a, you know, food shortage, too. Right. I'm being them. Okay. Um, or someone's paying them to, you know, stu- you know yeah. take specifically the food to shut off the city. Mm-hmm. Between, between Drake and... maybe they're um, doing it themselves because, like, you know, yeah. get some farmland. Between uh, Draken's knowledge role and what uh, Captain Vozlov knows, like, you know, they... They've, they're they very good at living off the land and providing for themselves. Um, you know, basically just do, like, sus- some sustainment farming and a lot of hunting. Um, so, like... Are them... you guys doing hunting? Because maybe it's causing them to feel competitive and they're doing <laughs> what they kind of drive you out. Could be. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, Draken, you would also know that, um, you know, a lot of the... The mountain, the tribes in the mountains have been being slowly pushed uh, east um, by um, basically Northwatch being the the current rulers, kind of being a dick to the tribes as a whole. Um, so they've been kind of getting pushed east for a while. Interesting. I'm sure they're loving that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dang it, Bobby. Dang it, Bobby. <laughs> yeah, might might be one of Ember Gale's children being an asshole. <laughs> and don't they also want this city to not exist or like this whole not a fan of this? Uh not myth? not Northwatch. Um okay. e- East Haven is the one who has some beef from what you have heard via rumors okay. and such. Um, but yeah, so what are you guys planning? I think going to check out the site makes sense. It may make sense for us to escort, like, one of the next shipments out to, like, the next mm-hmm. town. Though all said, like, our shipments out don't seem to be the real target. It's stuff coming in. Yeah. Yeah. So we could also go plan to try to meet the next food shipment. Just to make sure it gets through if we wanted. Yeah. But so so like protecting one shipment isn't really gonna address the problem. No, but it just not the whole way, but through the yeah. that part. Yeah. It the hopes that they attack. Find them is sort of what I'm thinking of. What's that, Zach? It it wouldn't let us like it wouldn't solve the problem, but it would let us find them. Yeah. I mean, maybe if they hit your specific caravan, like there's a bunch coming and going, like you're kind of, you know, you're sort of like, what's the right metaphor for this? Like you, you, you got like a bag of grains of rice and you're like basically just throwing a couple grains in there that might explode if they grab the wrong grain of rice. But like, Mm -hmm. it's still a big bag of rice, you know? (laughs) Yeah, yeah. (laughs) Yeah, so I'd say maybe we don't waste time with a slow caravan and get ourselves out to the last yeah. ambush, right? Have all the ambushes been in, like, a pretty close vicinity of each other, or is it, like, a whole stretch of road that's been getting hit? Um, it's... Here, let me get... Oh, I don't really have roads on the map, do I? Let me... Um, let me take a look at the world map here. Um, so you guys... Oh, yeah, there's not really... Um, yeah, so there are your two roads. 
or your, your three roads. Uh, so the trade isn't crossing the river because there isn't anything coming from East Haven. It's all either going to and from uh, Tunstead's Point or Wave Meat. Um, here, let me zoom in a little. Can't wait to have a vacation in Isle of Woe. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, so it's it's mostly this um, it's mostly this road that goes along the mountains that's getting hit. Like they're they're kind of it seems like they're doing like smash and grabs. Like you know, come out of the yeah. mountains, maybe like a day's travel worth or something. So mo most of the stuff has been on this road here. Also, now looking at the map, it is interesting to know that, like, we had set up a pretty good Agamid group up here. Yeah. The fact that they're getting pushed all the way out past East Haven, all the way out this way. I mean, it's unlikely it's the same group, but, yeah. th like, there are multiple so, tribes in the mountains. If um, all these tribes are pushing this way, they're pushing yeah. each other. Yeah, yeah. So there's probably some competition happening i also feel like they could build a ro road here and just avoid the mountains but <laughs> <laughs> i mean that's still like i know it looks small here but that's like 100 miles <laughs> that added quite a bit onto a, a food trek yeah mm -hmm. um but yeah, so we'll get you guys. Oh, actually, yeah, you're probably just on the world map for now. Um, so what are you guys actually doing? I don't think the easiest thing is to go check out the original, or the the latest ambush point. Yeah, the last ambush. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. Here, I'm going to be a lady. <laughs> oh, I don't have a cool thing. I'm not doing that then. Whoops. <laughs> um, all right. So you guys are getting all your stuff together, heading out. Yeah, gearing yep. up our bennies. Oh yeah, yeah, I gotta give you guys the bennies. Thank you. Grabbing our three poker chips or right. four poker. I think it should just be three, right? I'm not... I need two. Pi I need two piles. Right. You need. Uh, you need another three, right? Two. Oh, two. Okay. Then, just one more for me. All right. Cool. Bennies. All righty. So you guys uh, head out along the road for maybe like a, a day or two on foot. Um pretty uneventful journey you're traveling on a pretty well-traveled road that's usually left alone with the exception of the agamid attacks there um and you guys arrive at the site which i unfortunately don't have a map for or anything uh, <laughs> but um but you get there and uh you see a couple of wagons that have been uh overturned and just like ransacked um you know pretty easy to tell there was an attack here i don't they just take the wagons <laughs> 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 hey all this stuff's conveniently set up to travel let's break <laughs> let's break the conveyance and walk off with it yay <laughs> yes yeah, so let's give the the looters better advice on looting <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so you guys are at the site what are you checking stuff out try to see if we can figure out how they attacked and you know what their typical yeah, like, what was the, ambush what was, was like what went down All right. yeah like did their tracks did their tracks come from come from one direction and leave another um so yeah, uh, Sykes, go ahead and make a survival check, um, and I'm going to have the captain assist you. Um, so let me roll her thing, and that will add to your roll. Um, not that you need it, but... Oh, yeah, so it kind of doesn't matter, but she's helping you as well. 
Um, but yeah, with the four, you're able to you're able to see. Um, yeah, they basically they attack from the direction of the mountains, um, and yeah, it was like a sort of a quick smash and grab. They pretty much crippled the wagons, or you think they crippled the wagons to prevent them from escaping. Um, but it looks like it was a very small force. Um, let's see. Yeah, I was gonna ask if I could try, you know, if I could tell about how many it was with footprints. Yeah. Um, that was Humperdinck skill. Not. <laughs> <laughs> That's not otter. It's it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Uh, what are you doing there, Jamrel? I'm just using my uh, blood sense for detection, just making sure that's up and running. That like oh, okay. we are alone in the site. Yeah, yeah. You don't you don't sense anyone within range of, of you. Um, you guys are pretty much alone out here. Um, but yeah, so back to the the tracks, uh, Drake, and you can. It it, it looks it's kind of weird. It looked like you're actually having a lot of trouble trying to find out their exact numbers. Um, like at first, you think from all the the tracks where the fight happened it looks like a pretty large party um but then as they retreat up into the mountains it looks like it's maybe like maybe like eight eight to ten uh dudes or eight to ten individuals <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah, like lo looking at the fight, it's hard to tell with all the the mess in the fight, but it kind of feels like a larger force than that. So maybe not all of them returned the same way. Yeah. Well, there's no bodies around. Is there um is there ways to like clone or temporarily like duplicate yourself in this magic system? Uh I'm an ally, kind of. Yeah, like yeah, you can do the mirror image. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, you think one of them Naruto do? <laughs> I'm just trying to come up with way, like, you yeah. know, why it would appear like there'd be more at times than others. Uh, just mm -hmm. make a smarts roll. Yeah, maybe that. Maybe it's from like trampling over, moving the stuff. Maybe they also have. Maybe they have sleds or something. Um. Okay. Yeah, you got the four. Um. Yeah, you guys. Realize they're probably hiding their they're probably hiding their numbers when they're moving. So moving in lines and yeah, tracks. yeah, like star um, troopers. Yeah, you you no. didn't like initially like, uh, see that with the with the, with the yeah the <laughs> <laughs> they're moving in single file to hide their numbers, um, something like <laughs> that. But yeah, like you you didn't initially spot that with the the regular like you would have spotted that yeah. with the rays on survival, but. Um, you know, not with the gotcha. regular success, but with the regular success, you, you can, you know where they're heading. Um, it's going to be a little difficult to track them, but they were in a rush. Um, so essentially no modifier on your survival check to, to keep following them. Alrighty. Um, is there anything of use here left or anything else we want to look at? Ah, uh, just, uh, just a wagon that needs a, a new wheel. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> You're just like, ah. I clearly don't see anything else of importance here. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> Get those out of the way now. <laughs> right. <laughs> so earlier, I don't think... Yeah. I I made a boating roll for uh, Otterts because he was like, well, you know, if the sail was this way, <laughs> doesn't know much about tracking on land, but uh, apparently he notices something. It's like the like, wagon blew over from all the wind. Uh, Otterts, <laughs> uh, Otterts, you find a bunch of valuables still left in the wagon, um, just like mm -hmm. trinkets and stuff that probably got missed, um, worth about 300 uh, crowns. Make a stealth check. To, <laughs> so, so the if you want to hide it from the party, make a stealth check. <laughs> <laughs> well, I meant more from like the oh, other the, one. the captain. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but also, yeah, if you want to hide it from the party. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, hey guys, check out what I found. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
maybe maybe he's like, oh shit, it's almost our anniversary, and I forgot to get the wife. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and of course the captain's like, we should make sure that gets back to their proper owners, <laughs> okay. but doesn't really push the issue. <laughs> Where'd the yeah. minus two come from, though? What's oh. that? Apparently, uh, I can follow the tracks when we're ready to get okay. moving. Yeah, so. Um, you have fatigue or, or oh, you're encumbered. Hey, oh yeah, Otters, you're, you're encumbered or something. Uh oh. Because uh, it's giving you a minus roll. two on your on your stuff. Yeah, I mean that's still a crit fail either way. <laughs> Do I? Have, it looks like I have two wound now. Where's the let me fatigue? look at your. Let me check out your sheet. I have two fatigue set. I don't know where that was. From. Oh yeah, you should have zero fatigue. Yeah. I don't know why that was there. That's weird. All right. Yeah, I was like, how'd you get a negative one? <laughs> <laughs> That's um, a good question. But yeah, Draken and uh, Captain Vozlov for tracking the footprints without really any issues. Um, and you're, uh, so you're following a path, uh, up into the mountains. Um, and you guys are traveling for, uh, you know, maybe like half a day. Um, and you get to this sort of precarious path. Um, and everyone make notice checks. Uh-oh. <laughs> I mean, four is a success, right? That's know. a three and a three, yeah. I see someone with a five. Oh. Yeah, I got a five. I All got right. a four and a one. All yeah. right, so a four. I uh, just need one. Oh, yeah, and I'm going to I'm gonna assume Gallus is coming with you guys. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, does Ooh. one of you want to... Uh, Steve's character. Oh. Does one of you want to drive him? I'm already driving, too, so I'm going to go okay. with <laughs> yeah, I can if you want. But. All right. Uh, here, I'm, I'll do his notice roll. Oh, fuck Moroku! <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Um, I was like, hey, do you see that? Moroku's like, I see everything. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right. Uh, Dave, I'll give you permission on uh, on Gallus for today. Okay. Uh, so you should hmm. be able to... Uh, all right. Baroka can tell how long the captain's been doing Kegels. About 20 minutes now, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> right, that's, a, that's a clip from uh, from Night Court. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I gotta roll her notice. She's fine. <laughs> Alright. I have to set up the map, because... Well, I just have to drag you guys onto the map. Uh, or, yeah, I can just move you there. So you guys are on this path. Um, you are at the bottom here. Uh, so feel free to drag your tokens there. Uh, figure out your order of movement and such. I assume uh, Draken and uh, Katya are going to be kind of toward the front because you're doing the uh, the tracking. Yeah, makes sense. Um, and then, yeah, Gallus is probably like right behind them, right? Yeah. He's and a long sure Otter is healed. Oh, yeah, Otter, it's, you got your power points fully. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Reset those. All right, this is everybody. It keeps looking like less because I'm like trying to remember how many people are in this group. <laughs> I, I can't uh, if, if I can't move my token and I think oh, I'm over shit. somebody. A bit, just because where, where the where it is on the map has them underneath everybody's picture. Oh. Okay. Uh, to front. Can you see now? No, it, it, it's like like Dave, like David F and Zachary W and I T I and D and. Oh, and all the... of it. It, okay. Uh, <laughs> shrink the um. If you go to the settings, you can set the chat avatars to name only. Uh. Also, try zooming out on the map. That too. And Zoom scroll all the way out. Oh, Jesus. All right. That's, I find the name yeah. pretty necessary. To I have to get rid of everyone's pictures, though, in order to see. Yeah. 
That's true, yeah. Alright, well, that's weird. But, um... Uh, but, yeah, so... You guys are moving up the path. Um... You guys who all made the notice checks see this ambush about to happen. Um, Otterts and Gallus do not. Um, so you guys are going to be surprised. Um, so I'm just going to... Uh, shit. Yeah, there we go. Alright, <laughs> there you go. There's your little surprise icon. <laughs> what was that noise? Um, and now I have to do initiative. So give me a second here. Oh, oh, gee, oh, that you got your. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's right, just his we, range of yeah, 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 people. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is it fifth? Is fifteen feet right, or is it ten feet? Oh, why is it feet? Two inch, yeah, it should, feet sorry, I. I yep, this should not be in feet. It should be in inches. But fifteen feet, I guess, would be right. Oh my god! <laughs> no, he doesn't have fifteen inches. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just, See, that's why we don't need a range character. I am the range character. Yeah, you're just piking people across the mountain. Um, oh my god. There, sorry, I'm just trying to get everyone's turns in. Um, so you guys who didn't make the notice roll, you basically don't get a turn, because that's how ambushes work. and It's pretty much how surprise works in D&D. &D. Mm -hmm. Right, um, but they're still dealt, because... Yeah, yeah. Because they... Cause no, you are things. actually not dealt if you are on surprise. Yeah. I, I double checked the rules on this like uh, an okay. hour ago. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, oh yeah, so Otterts, you are off. Oh, whoops. Remind oh, me to right add right you right. next You're turn, on. though. Yeah. Um, and mm -hmm. then yeah, Gallus doesn't get a turn either. Um, all right, so deal ish. Yeah. Too bad nobody took alert. <laughs> oh shit! And I need to, I need to fix the fucking. Ah, uh, the API sandbox. <laughs> so my macros work. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. Every fucking time. There we go. All right. So. All right. Shippo immediately sees like, oh shit, something's weird. What's he doing? Uh. Is, are the enemies supposed to be on the map yet? Ah, uh, they are not on the map yet. They're ambushing <laughs> you. But you guys who made the notice roll know something is up. Uh, I, uh yeah, he's gonna warn everyone that there's that that there's like an ambush. Like, there's something funny going on on yeah. here, Moroku. Like, we should take some cover. Yeah, I mean, like, you still get an action and everything. It's Kind of assume that's what you're doing. I mean, I, I don't have any targets. Yeah. So. <laughs> I mean, you can go on hold and wait for a target. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll just go on hold and wait for a target. Okay. So I'll put you to... Put you on H. All right. Um, so, this you guys see this dude pop out of a bush. Uh, <laughs> and I need his character sheet. Hold on. Uh, oh, and I've still, I still... I haven't changed my fucking ambient shit. You guys are out in the mountains. <laughs> We're about to be attacked by a West Side Story. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Mountain Pass. I'll, I'll give you some battle music. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go. Shazam. Speaking of The Witcher, did anyone watch their... Uh... Watch the second season yet, so we can talk about it. <laughs> We're streaming, though. Don't spoil it. <laughs> Everyone will come to my stream and be like, Why the fuck are you talking about The Witcher? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Everyone will just go watch a video to hate on you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it is the internet. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right, point. so... Bye, internet. Who is he attacking? Um... Probably the big meaty guy out in front. So, uh, Draken, you're getting a crossbow Sh shot at you. Shippo wants to try to. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, take make a uh, make an agility roll. <laughs> nope. Oh. 
I mean, you could still roll it. All right. Yeah. So, <laughs> so the bandit's gonna go, and then you're gonna go. So crossbow at Draken. Um, no modifiers, cause I think yeah, you're in short range. You're not surprised or anything, cause you made the the notice roll. Um, so a five will hit you, cause you don't have cover, right? I uh, yeah, I don't have cover. All right. That I know. Of. Um, let's see, and then. <laughs> I don't think a four hurts you though. Now my toughness is twelve. <laughs> yeah. So this guy pops out of the bush, fires a crossbow at you, and it just kind of like, pink goes off your armor. Um, and then uh, yeah, Shippo, you can uh, take your action now. All right. I'm, I'm gonna cast slumber as an AOE. <laughs> But of course, this doesn't explain to me how to do that. Oh, uh, shit. That doesn't have, have a... Uh, it, it, doesn't... it doesn't have, like, a tooltip when you use the when you use the uh, lock thing. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, are you doing a medium or a large? I'm going to do a medium. I'll figure out the... Okay. Bit and strong. I'll figure out the power points in a, in a second. All right. But yeah, so they roll a <laughs> spirit... Yeah. Where's right. the templates? Oh, uh, they, I think they're at the... Oh, fuck. Oh, Do not have there. them in this game? Oh, no, they're at the top. No, Sorry. they're right there at the yep. top. Sorry, I have them at the top in this game and at the bottom in another. Yeah. So, I'll do this. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, yeah, make your caster check. All right, so standard roll, and that's against spirit. Uh, yes, uh, but uh, but it is a minus two, because uh, I'm paying the power points for it. Oh, okay. Well, that guy failed, and that guy did not. Um, so the one <laughs> the one you're targeting goes to sleep. I'm, <laughs> so a, like... I'm a hero! <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, this guy... Oh, where's my fucking... There we go. He's uh, He is now sleeping. <laughs> um... And that's all you see happen. Uh, <laughs> another one is this guy. So this guy's going to pop out. Uh, you see another one up in front. Um, they seem pretty fixated on the angry dragon man. So another shot at you, Draken. Uh, that's a miss. Uh, let's see. Another one. Um, <laughs> this guy pops out. Um just saw the weird uh, tiny fox man put a guy to sleep, so he's gonna shoot at you. Miss. <laughs> uh, another bandit. You just missed this one with that with that AOE, by the way. <laughs> um. Yeah, you tried to sleep him, so or kind of did. So he's gonna shoot at you, Shippo. Uh, oh fuck. Uh, that's a raise, oh. right? Uh, no, because I have cover for my shield. Oh, okay. Oh. Uh, uh, so regular wait, hit? No. It's still a raise, right? Because, no, six. Cause it needs an eight to a be six. a raise, yeah. Yeah, so, no, then just All regular right. hit. Regular yeah. hit. Uh, here's the damage. Uh, it is eight AP2. I have two... Oh, I, here. Have I, gotta... eight, I have an eight, but two of that's armor, so that is, so that would be a five. Uh, yeah, so yeah, one, one so success. No rate, so, so just shaking, just shaking. Yeah. All right. Uh, Jamral. Um, yeah, make a notice check. Okay. I was going to do spell casting to know where everybody is in 10 Oh, square <laughs> I, I mean, so, combat's yeah. starting, so I'm just giving you guys free notice checks to see the ones that are hidden. Uh, yeah, you you pretty much see the rest of them with that 8. <laughs> um, yeah. and I'll, so I'll reveal them. Um, shit. Oh, yep, sorry, wrong thing. There we go. Layer token... Layer token. There we go. Token. All right. Um, 
And there's a couple more up here that... Yeah. Alright. Alright. Your turn, Jamril. Alright. Um, what's the terrain looking like? Is this all, like, uphill mountainous, or is it... Uh, like... It's, like, it's kind of difficult terrain off the road, so it'd be, like... Um, how does... Fuck. How does difficult terrain work in this? Happy <laughs> pace. Half your pace? Okay, yeah, so it's, it's like 5e. Yeah, yeah, it's like 5e. It'd be double your um, your pace. Alright, hold on. I want to see... Unless you have fleet-footed or parkour, and then you can ignore that shit. Yeah, I think parkour is the one that looks like... Yeah, I think it's just... parkour, not yeah. fleet-footed. That's what I have. <laughs> oh, God. Here. There you go. Alright, I'm going to cast stun. Are you par <laughs> parkouring with the, with the fucking pike? <laughs> <laughs> No, no, I don't. That would be amazing. I run fast. I oh, I took oh. running fast instead of parkour. Right, I'm gonna reroll that. Yeah, that's <laughs> Jesus. On a D10, come on, roll twenty. There you go. <laughs> All right, so that is still just a regular success. Uh, um, yes, I think so. Yeah, and that hey, is. Um, but I do have the blood bond. Uh, oh, so, it's a plus two. so that gives you a plus two. All right, so yeah, that's actually, a raise. Yeah, it's actually not raised because it's, it's on me, not on them. So it's nine. Nice. Um, so they make a vigor roll. At minus two because I got yeah. it ra raised. All right, it's one, two, three, four. I'm gonna just leave the sleeping guy alone. I'm assuming you're not concerned with that. <laughs> I mean, he could be sleeping and stunned. Yeah. <laughs> Um, alright, so this is one, two, three, four. I'll do five, alright. Uh, just two. So that's a fail. That's a fail. <laughs> that's a fail. <laughs> ah, that is a fail, and. That's a fail. So all of those guys are stunned. <laughs> Every single fucking one of them. <laughs> Just so I understand, is the vigor roll versus my roll or versus the standard four? Ah, uh, the standard, standard four, four, which okay. is why your raise gives them a minus two on it. Good. Okay. Um, but I mean, yeah, it does. It does kind of suck because we we used to play it where it was against the casting roll, <laughs> which made it way better. <laughs> like now nah, you're you're done forever. <laughs> right. Uh oh shit. Do I not? I don't have a. Oh, I don't have a quick one for stun. Um, but yeah, all those dudes are stunned. Uh, Draken, you're up next. There's a bunch of ass. Well, a bunch of assholes were shooting at you with crossbows. You just saw a bunch of them, like, fucking fall over. <laughs> yeah, how long does stun last? Um, until they, they recover. Uh, yeah, until they roll to recover out of it. Okay, so not a, like, one turn and done thing, necessarily. Not, be, necessarily. not necessarily. Yeah. Well, they're gonna lose their next action, their next yeah. turn, regardless. Yeah. Um, and but then, you have the drop while attacking someone who is stunned. <laughs> so, you know. Do you have sweep? That'd be hilarious. Cause that, oh I'm my god! Take it. You could sweep those, but also yeah. remember sweep will hit us if, if, with... Yeah, you know. yeah. Okay. So go be, a, go be a food processor somewhere else. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, I don't have sweep, unfortunately. But I am gonna, I guess, attack the... Hold on. They get frenzy, right? Oh yeah, I do have frenzy. What's frenzy do again? Uh, uh, two dice, two skill dice. Yeah, yeah. Extra attack. All right, so I do want more than one in range. Um, you're gonna have plus four to hit and damage on all of these, by the way. Oh, so do multi action. Yeah. Since since it'll off since that will offset your penalty. Alrighty. Um, yeah, I would um I would how? try to I would try to do your frenzy to hit two of them and then do your multi action to hit the third one, with a normal attack. Um, but basically, you'll take a minus two to uh, all your rolls this turn. Um, okay. But you're you're at a plus four, so it, you know. So I'm still at a plus two. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so is that uh, the trait modifier would be a two? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, shit. What is there? Dang. Uh, they hey, have a parry of five, so that hey, won't hit. Um, hey. Yeah, and you didn't frenzy. Either. Do you have frenzy set up? I or... probably do not. Oh, do you have frenzy? 
I do have frenzy. Okay. Here. Evan, I'm gonna, frenzy I'm gonna go on your I'm gonna go on your sheet and mess with that. Um, okay. Oh yeah. So when you do when you do attack, uh, and it should have asked you for how many attacks you're doing when you clicked on the pike, right? What? Does he oh, have you just you clicked on fighting. Pick. Yeah, go to your right. weapons and click on your pike. Oh. And, and it should ask you for number of attacks, and so two is basically a frenzy. Okay, and so number of skill dice would be number of attacks. Would be yeah, two. yeah. Did you take improved frenzy? Cause there you, you go. Did. So, I did not take yeah. improved frenzy. So the eight hits the first one, the six hits the second one. Um, roll damage, and you got plus four on the damage. Um, and you can click the button in the chat window if you just want to do that. And two on the damage or four on the damage? Four on the damage. Because you have the drop on them. Ah, <laughs> that guy's very dead. Ah. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, that is definitely shaken and a wound. Um, nice. That is shaken and a wound. <laughs> All right, Does and the then... not have AP? No, uh, mo not. most things don't. Um, yeah. I think the only melee weapon that comes with it is the uh, the battle axe. Yeah, yeah, and I, I, I like my range with the pike. Yeah. All right, and then All do right. your uh, regular attack against the third guy. <laughs> oh, all right. So, <laughs> unless you want to Benny that, that's a miss. Eh, I'm gonna Benny it. Yeah. Just clean this shit up. <laughs> Alright, yeah, roll the damage. That's definitely a raise. And that's uh, actually plus 11. two more. Oh, uh... I only did plus, plus two instead of four. Oh, okay. So that is... Uh, 11 13. plus 13. Yeah. I, I'm pretty sure he's dead, but I'm gonna do this just so you can... I don't know if this shows it to you, but so 13 damage, Hello, zero AP. Uh, yeah, yeah, six above toughness. Oh yeah, you guys see that, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Bone so, you banned it. Yep. Yeah. So that's a uh, yep. I think that's just yeah. That was just shy of another of another raise, but yeah, shaken and a wound. That is dead. Um, all right, and you can still use the rest of your movement if you want. <laughs> Yeah, um, like he can just, close the gap. Yeah, oh. just just keep in mind this is difficult terrain right here. Yeah, I do have a pace of eight. Right, right. Um, yeah, but, but he yeah, has, he has more just kind right? of back. No, okay. I just have fleet. Oh. Yeah. All right, uh, is that just it for you? Just go onto the trail. Yep, and that way if anybody closes, I can stick them. Oh, well, look what is about to happen. You see this guy <laughs> with a hat come out of the bushes, and he pulls out a... Um, well, these things get a long sword. Yeah, he's got a long sword. You see this, you know, leaderish looking bandit comes out of the bushes, and uh, he's gonna, you know, try to charge at you. Um, but yeah, you can make your attack. Um, I think that will actually hit him. Yep, that meets his parry. So roll your damage. Oh, and he is a wild card, so I gotta put the. Uh, oh fuck! So yeah, how about fifteen? Yep. All right. Uh, <laughs> and I don't get any bonuses to damage against him because he's not stunned. Right. Um, so that's sure, fifteen yeah. damage, no AP. Um, that is two wounds. He is going to attempt to soak because he is a wild card. Um, so vigor check. Let's do that. Oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So you. He comes charging at you, and you're almost like dead on like about to shank him and he sort of like dr goes he does like the the rocker slide like onto his knees and your your pike takes his hat off <laughs> <laughs> all righty um, and yeah but he but he spent one of his bennies so you know um and he's gonna make a i don't think oh he does have yeah he's gonna make a frenzy attack against you um so that is Oh shit, this is not set up to frenzy. Hold on. Oh. Alright, there we go. Why are you not doing the thing? Oh. Oh, okay, there we go. So, ah, uh, do either of those beat your parry? Or meet your parry? I have a parry of six. So Alright, so like the, 
Yeah, the seven will hit, um, but he's got to beat a 12 on your toughness, right? Yep. All right. So, nope. Just kind of takes a swing at you, bounces off your armor. Um, and he's like, oh, I think I've made a mistake. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> <laughs> all right and um, I, used, I forgot to throw the benny earlier so i threw it oh, down okay now. thank you um let's see next up we have the captain here uh she's probably just gonna try to take out uh, those two dudes up there so you, you guys see take, her whip out a, uh, take him alive. <laughs> yeah um <laughs> oh yeah i forget what she can do hold on what's her shit sorry guys i probably should have uh, Alright, Grimdon gets the best of us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Are you playing uh, Grimdon? Yeah, yeah. Do you have it? Yeah! Oh, man. Uh, Alright. Okay, good. <laughs> we'll talk more about this after, after right. streaming. Oh, so she's got Marksman. So yeah, she's going to stay where she's standing, get the bonus from Marksman. Um, and, uh... Yeah, you know what? She's going to do two shots. Fire one at each of these. going to multi-action. Um, so with Marksman, that'll cancel out to a minus one. Um, so she's just going to do two longbow attacks. Uh, one at each. So, nice. That's a hit. Uh, um, I think that is enough to wound him. Or at least shake him. Sorry, math is hard. Ah, uh, that is eight. Oh, yeah, so he's just shaking. All right. So toggle shaking. Um, and then attack on the second guy. Uh, minus one. <laughs> uh, why is that? Why is that saying bonus damage? Because you probably do what I do and just pressed up and enter. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, I see what's happening. All right. I think I remember why I set her up this way, too. So she's supposed to be making a shooting roll. All right. There we go. <laughs> uh, I'm going to spend one of her bennies. Or, yeah. I'm going to use one of her bennies because that's sad. Uh, so that hits. <laughs> um, okay. And then damage for longbow is... All right. So that's another eight. So that's another shaken bandit. Uh, and bandit. That is planned. <laughs> All right. Which is this? Why is this one not showing up here? Way up. Oh, he's way up. Thank you. <laughs> you can scale the mountain down. All right. Yeah. Well, they have crossbows. So <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Who is? Yeah, they're kind of like. Scary dragon guy, fight the boss is fighting. <laughs> like we gotta help the boss. Yeah, they're like, oh shit. <laughs> um, so crossbow, I think that's that's gonna be at minus one because they're at medium range from there. Um, oh, that's a hit. Uh, and this is AP two. Uh oh. Um, that might hurt you, Chris. Yeah, how's uh, AP work? Uh, AP just subtracts directly from armor with the count here. Wound calculations. Uh, so that is 13 damage. AP 2. Um, so that will just shake you. Oh, man. that He just missed the raise. <laughs> yeah, I was like, no, I think that's going to be just below. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so shaken. Yeah, so uh, you'll get a free roll to get out of it at the start of your turn. Um, alternatively, you can just spend a Benny whenever to be unshaken. Okay. Um, but you're not wounded, so... Uh, and that's... the reason why you might want to do that is just because if once you're shaken, you can... If you get another shaken, you can uh, take a wound. That is a dead bandit. Yeah. Uh, that is another dead bandit. Uh, Moroku, you're up. Uh, you got crossbows flying around. Captain Vozlov shooting arrows at dudes. Hey. <laughs> um... So, I can, like, see... It. These guys can hear me, right? Uh, what do you mean? Because, uh, like, I want to... Oh, wait, that's... Oh, wait, the ship us. The ship us, the taunt build. Yeah. Uh... Uh... 
Um. Oh yeah, you also get a, you get like a bonus to your shake roll if if you're within uh, my aura. Let me throw that up then. Oh yeah, yeah, because you got um, you're, it's fine. you're doing uh, the, I the command, <laughs> yeah. Either. I can't click on my tokens. Oh, oh shit! Use it. No, my fault. I'm using the measuring button again. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. Yeah, it's easy to do. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna make this a less oppressive color, if you don't mind. Yeah, I'll, cha I'll change it. Okay. Right. <laughs> All right. I'm, uh, Chris, I'm probably gonna do that with your guy too, just so it's like a lighter shade of something. Yeah. Um, there's that. Oh, there. Too bad you can't, like, yeah. yeah, too bad you can't do like a uh, an alpha. Right. <laughs> um, let's see. Here, there you go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, oh, you got. Is the there a way to like toggle it so that it's not always on? Uh, basically, just open up the settings and click the. Uh, I guess click the check marks or something. I don't have a, a check. You might have to delete the radius to get to get leave. Oh yeah. Yeah. But but yeah, okay. I mean, so I'll just do that for I'll just do that when I need to check. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cause but yeah. Okay, so Um what are you doing for but, your turn? Um I think I'm going to also cast Slumber on, uh, I don't, I just need to check the, the blast template to see if it's able to, to hit all the three of them. Nope. Yeah, so I'm going to cast Slumber on these two using the medium blast template. Which two? Uh, the two up, the two for, uh... Oh, up here, up on the up top. Yeah. All right. Um. So that is a spirit roll. Yeah. All right. That's standard. So that is a fail, and that's a success. So this one goes down. Sleepy, sleepy. <laughs> I think that the one that's the one that was going next. So. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and then, uh, oh, and then uh, I'm gonna position myself over over here to uh, try to gain some uh, tactical advantage for for Draken after he wakes up. <laughs> All right, uh, is that it for you? Yep. All right. Uh, next up is the bandit you just put to sleep. He is asleep, so he is effectively out. Uh, there we go. Uh, all right. Uh, this dude is shaken. Roll to unshake. Uh, where is his? There we go. Unshake. Nope. Uh, he's just like, fuck this. And he uh, just books it. Oh, wait. Hold on. That's not what he. Hold on. He's just, yeah, booking it out of there as fast as he can. Uh, six inches. And yeah, you know what? He's going to run. <laughs> so what is his. Can I roll that on him? What the fuck? Oh, here we go. All right, so he gets another two. All right. Yeah, you guys just see that dude get out of the bushes and run up the path. Um, and I believe we are on a new round. Um, I added uh, Gallus and Otter, so you guys should get your turns this time. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> How dare you? Uh, um, all right, new round. All right, the bandit who is running away is first. <laughs> uh, unshake. All right, he unshakes, but he's still running the fuck away. 
He's like, nope, nope. Ah, <laughs> uh, Jamral, you are up. Hmm. I'm like, how ruthless do I want to be? Let's do it. For the lulls. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, <All you're>, right. <laughs> you pull out the blood sword. Yep, then he's gonna so it's come got... to there. Uh, keep in mind that's difficult terrain, though. Oh, the whole thing? So can't yeah. Can I run just to get a little further? Yeah. That's pretty much all I can do this turn. Yeah, but you'll be you'll be at a minus two to on your actions if you do the run. Oh, yeah, yeah. you only got another, basically another inch. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much all I did. How's all that right. going? All right. Um, so that's it for you. Uh, Bandit, where's this one? Oh, that's the one up top. Ah, uh, you're... Moroku, you're shooting sleep shit at him, so you're getting a crossbow. Um, I believe this is just outside of his range as well. Roll a one! Roll a one! Hit your friend! Yeah, so medium range, so he's at minus two. Uh, minus two. <laughs> that means he hit his friend. Yeah. It is a bystander. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, because that's on the shooting roll. Yeah. Um, well, it's either him or, oh uh, yeah, no, he'll hit his friend. He's in the way. Uh, so rolling damage. Uh, so ten on the fucking bandit captain. <laughs> <laughs> we don't got to do nothing. I'll take care of themselves. <laughs> uh, that's a fucking hit <laughs> <in> a wound. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, he's gonna fucking try to soak with his other Benny. Uh, so that's Vigor. I knew you had it in for me, Man. Gary, but really? So yeah, you guys just see the, you know, the crossbow, like, stick in the back, like, just enough to punch through his armor, and he, like, turns around, he's like, Hey, what the fuck? It's like, shoot them! <laughs> and he's out of Benny's. Uh... That's it for Bandit there. Uh, this dude is going to unshake, or try to. Uh, he fails. He's going to fucking book it also. Uh, yep, so he's just like, no, fuck, 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 fuck. Uh, he just goes up there. All right. Bandit captain. <laughs> uh, let's see. Now, is he shaken or not from the damage? That no, because he, because he, um, because he soaked it. Um, okay. if you if you soak all of the wounds, uh, you remove shaken as well. Gotcha. Um, all right, Moroku, he's attacking you because you're squishy. Um, so you're getting uh, actually no, he's gonna do he can frenzy, so he's gonna do one at each of you. Um, so first one's at Draken, second one's at Moroku. Uh. There we go. Uh, <laughs> so seven and a ten. I have a parry of six. All right. Uh, so not a raise, at least. Yeah. Oh no, the ten is well. a raise. Shit. Um, and I think that hits you, um, Draken. The seven. Yeah. Okay. But regular hit. Six. Yeah. So regular hit on Draken. Uh, I don't think a seven is anywhere close right. yeah. um, and then on Roku uh, seven what is your toughness oh well, he got the raise oh shit so that's 17 yeah. okay <laughs> thank you for reminding me um, uh, so that's so a, I have a toughness of eight yeah so that's uh, one hit and or so yeah shaken in two wounds do you want to try and soak yeah, <laughs> that's my bigger is I'm going to attempt to soak. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Okay, so... Maroku uses a penny. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so you soaked one of the... You still took a wound. I'm um, gonna... I... Are you gonna try to reroll? Yeah. All right. Benny the Benny? Uh, yes. Because... 
Yeah. Game. All right. So that's uh, that is one wound. Um, so that's the red dot on you. Uh, oh yeah, and you're you're shaking, right? Because you got to soak all of the wounds. Um, yeah. And I got to be a dick and do what your injury is. Um, so yeah, he kind of like cuts you across the the guts. He's like swinging his sword around at you and Draken and he manages to catch you like in the side. Um, I'm telling you, I already have a D4 vigor. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Alright, uh, Draken, it is you. Uh, roll spirit to unshake. You also get a plus two because you're within the command range. And you add a plus two, yeah. Uh, yep, you are unshaken, you can act normally. Woohoo! And yeah, I'm a frenzy. <laughs> Stabbed the shit out of this dude. <laughs> uh, no bonuses this time, just the. Ah, uh, you straight. get plus one for the gang up. Oh, actually, no, no you don't. Because I'm shaking. And he's got block anyway, so. Um, but yeah. Uh, dad eleven will hit. Uh, that is a hit with a raise. Uh, so roll the did you damage. Unclick, did you unclick your shaking thing? Because it keeps asking you if you want to unshake. Oh. I did not, but there's 24. Uh, yeah. yeah, 24 on the fucking... <laughs> um, yeah, let's uh, let's do that. 24, uh, no AP. And he's out of bennies. Yep, yep, that will take out the bandit. That's, <laughs> that's four fucking wounds, dude. <laughs> nice. So yeah, so you glad just... you didn't clarify that you were non-lethally taking him out. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to try. I might have to try casting heal on him so he can question him. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping to make him alive, but I'm not sure. That's. I think I just shish kebobbed him. Yeah. Well, he is a wild card, so he gets to make the sit yeah, the, the yeah, bleeding I'll... out roll and actually and yeah. I'll I'll make that or you know I'll do that to the end of combat. We'll uh I want to keep things moving. Uh that bandit <laughs> is dead. Otterts, you are up. Your buddies are in this massive fucking melee. Um <laughs> there's like arrows flying everywhere. There's you know dudes getting stabbed and cut and <laughs> yeah, running away. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looting the bodies. <laughs> um so okay. Can I see the dudes up there? Yeah, yeah, you can all you can see them all now. Okay. Oh, I think I didn't roll roll initiative for this dude. <laughs> uh, Whoops. Is, this one right here. Yeah, I don't think he's on the board. <laughs> all right, let me. Uh, yeah, let me. Uh... He's just been quietly watching all this. Like, nope, <laughs> no. <laughs> all right, I'll just put him on hold at the end of it. <laughs> Alright, sorry, there. I'm trying to figure out what my actual range is. Yeah, I'll have him go at the end. Yeah, these guys over here are sleeping, right? Ah, uh, they're stunned. They're stunned. Yeah. One of the guys is one, sleeping. This one is asleep, this one is stu just stunned. Okay. Um, Which means you get the drop on them if you're attacking them. Yeah, so I think that I'm gonna summon a bunch of allies. <laughs> <laughs> um, if you get allies up in here, yeah, up on the <laughs> just have well, start. <laughs> I, unfortunately, I can't reach up the way up there. It's eight eight inches because the, the you range can spend a power point first. to double your range. Yeah. Oh, can you? Can yeah, because there's yeah. some general modifiers and yeah, range is one of them. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> so that. You'll just put a bunch of. Uh... <laughs> How many are you summoning? Four. Oh god. <laughs> And these are the sentinels, right? Or the, the uh, sorry, the bodyguards. Right. Yeah, you don't have yeah, sentinel yeah. yet. Um, here, yeah, I, let me the I, I made tokens for him. <laughs> yeah, it's, but it's a spirit roll to actually do it, right? Uh, focus. Three. Your focus. And I feel skill. like at least one's going to be down lower, right? Or all four up there. Yeah, you can put them anywhere in range. And yeah, that's a raise, so they all got one toughness as well. Or not toughness, mm -hmm. one wound. Ah. <laughs> What do you mean one wound? Uh, they, they so die. normally they're extras, but now they can take a wound oh, before dying. Okay, okay. Um, and yeah, yeah where are you gonna put one there? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna put one there. All right. There. Uh, do you have yeah. control over these guys, by the way? Can you move I them? I do. Yeah, they're okay. on my turn. Cool, cool. I think they, no, I mean, all... can can you move the tokens? Sorry. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Uh, no, wait. One oh. Second. Sorry. Oh shit! Yeah, I think. I okay. All right. Cool. Uh -huh. 
<laughs> so, so yeah, put them wherever, and then you know have them take their actions. They have character sheets. <laughs> oh, do they have character sheets? Oh, yeah, nice. yeah, I got that um, all set up. So. <laughs> oh yeah, cool. cool. Start beating the fuck out of bandits, man. <laughs> all right, let's do this. Um, uh, this one's asleep, so I don't know if you want to even bother with him. Oh no, then I'll just put two here. Yeah, two and two, and give them give themselves the gang up bonus. <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right, so the one on the bottom there is getting hit. All right, shove him off the cliff. Uh, <laughs> that will hit. Uh, roll the damage. Oh, sorry. That that was the second one. I'm gonna assume that one will also hit. hit. Um, I think that second <laughs> one's a raise because they have. Oh, did you include the plus one? Wait, so that was supposed to be the damage, that 12 there. Oh, yeah, that was damage. So okay. the 12 is damage. Um, let's and then see. the second one is the one with the rays. Yeah. Uh, so first one is 12, and the second one is 10. <laughs> yeah, doesn't matter. That first one pummels him to death. So another dead <laughs> bandit. Uh, All right. So dead. Up, up top. We up got, top. <laughs> uh, unfortunately... Uh, with the plus one, that four will hit. Here, be. Uh, cause you're got the gang up bonus. Uh, five, yeah. I don't know, will will hurt them though. Um, oh no, that was the other attack roll. Sorry. Oh, uh, the five will hit, or the the yeah, six rather. Cool. But yeah, and then. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the first damage roll. Uh, yeah, I don't think a three will. No, but the nine. I the should nine. Do yeah. Yeah, that's the. Sorry. <laughs> I should have just done the nine. Uh. Nine. Well, no, the, the, that was two attacks. So yeah. The three. The uh, nine, the nine, nine shakes him. Nice. <laughs> All right, three taken. <laughs> oh shit! Did it resort the fucking? Oh god damn it! Well, you just skip down to Otter as soon as the nine should be all set. Yeah. Okay. Right. All right. Sorry. Otter, it's where are you at? That was you, right. Otter. It's... All right. Next up is. A bandit Sleepy who time. I think is... Where is he? Oh, Sleepy he's time. asleep. Yep, I should just take him off. Because he's not going anywhere. <laughs> uh, Shippo, you're up. I have to unshake. Did Shippo get shaken? Yeah, from oh. uh, the crossbow bolt. I totally forgot. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Shippo's like, fuck this. <laughs> fight some guys. Uh, are there any? Are there any that are still viable threats? I guess that guy. Which I'm gonna finish them off as soon as I get a turn, but it's probably not gonna happen. Yeah. Yeah, they haven't even. He hasn't even gotten his chance to roll out of stun yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Uh, just AOE taunt that guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what are you going to do? Be stunned? <laughs> <laughs> what a great move, you idiot. <laughs> Even I could have come up with a better plan. How do tests work when you're stunned? Do you, um, uh, stunned. All right, that doesn't help. Distracted There's... until they recover. Okay, so they have a they have a minus two uh, to resist tests. Yeah. Oh yeah, so they're all, they're already distracted and vulnerable, but they count as the drop. Mm -hmm. Um, are you just trying to wound him with your taunt? <laughs> uh, I I was trying to make him shaken so yeah. that uh, yeah, it's just for uh, shits and giggles because it's just a cleanup round at this yeah, point. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, so that is ah, uh, no. Does he only have a D four in that? Okay. Oh, because I was gonna use. I was. I thought it was. Uh, I asked you about. Oh, right. I asked you about using performance to uh, with rabble rouser to 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 do that. Oh, uh, okay. So can I roll my performance? Yeah. Yeah. yeah performance. <laughs> okay. I was like. Like, because I was like, like, because remember I was telling you, like, he doesn't so much use persuasion. He just, like, he just, like, pantomimes being ridiculously yeah. hungry or whatever to yeah. get into, like, ridiculous skill trips to get what he wants. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
uh, yeah, a five. Okay, so a five, <laughs> and he has to roll. He's at a minus two. Um, that's spirit, right? For for performance. Is uh, skill? yeah. Okay. So minus two. Ah, uh, that's a race. So yeah, he's shaking. <laughs> or did you want to do the creative combat? I, this here, I'll, I'll just. Yeah, sure. Let's, let's, oh, let's he's shaking. <laughs> there you go. Doesn't matter. He's shaking. <laughs> so you like this guy's like <laughs> rolling on the ground, like trying to like you know be coherent, and this strange fox man is. Dancing on his grave. <laughs> Dancing on his future grave. <laughs> no, look at me, I'm tied up. Ooh, I, I can't fight. I'm an idiot. <laughs> uh, who's got Gallus and what the hell is Gallus doing? <laughs> Gallus is swearing that he totally missed the entire fight. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Um, He's going to like move up and raise his shield and make sure Sleepy Boys up there don't don't like yeah turn around and try to start shooting back at you or whatever yeah okay um katya is gonna try to clean up that one asshole um so you guys see her actually like knock two arrows at once uh and sh let's see what's the range on that i think it's i think she ignores it anyway uh 14 uh longbow is Oh, yeah, it's just within short range. All right. So this is going to be one shooting roll, but two damage rolls. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> uh. <laughs> um, yeah, so you just see her, like, fire two arrows, and they kind of, like, go through those dudes' eyes. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, he's very dead. What, the, the ones that were running away? or No, uh... the one up here that was on the ledge that the elementals oh. are beating the fuck out of anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoops. She's like, yeah, I just don't want him shooting at us. Uh, Moroku, what are you up to? Uh, right, he has a turn still. Oh, yeah, you got to unshake. I do not get my bonus. <laughs> right. That's sad. Uh, yeah, and you'll be at a, well, yeah, your wounds will give you a minus one. <laughs> All right. Well, you're not shaking. <laughs> is this guy? Uh, is this guy alive? I guess since it's the cleanup. Uh, the one in front of you. Yeah. All right. Let me do the. Um, let's see. He's got four wounds, right? Uh, oops. No, I said four, not five. Um, so that's just a vigor roll, right? I think so, right? The, yeah. It's the bleeding out. Yeah, pig. yeah. Um, bleeding out. Hold on. I, I like can never actually find these rules. <laughs> oh, incapacitation. There we go. Uh, incapacitation. Uh, immediate vigor roll. Okay. So yeah, vigor roll. Um, what did he get? 14. 14. Wow. Okay. <laughs> With his three wounds. Uh, so <laughs> Ray's roll on injury table. Um, so he's still unconscious, but he gets a he gets an injury. He's, he, he I actually got to roll two injuries for him because of the the wound that dropped him. Um, but yeah, so he's still alive, but he's injured. Good. Yeah. All right. So if he's stable, I'll wait. I'll, yeah. I'll wait till uh, heal him outside of combat. Yeah. <laughs> it's good. Um. You can still heal yourself. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do that. <laughs> Golden hour. <laughs> uh, and where's the dang wound table? Let me roll that. I don't have that. All right. Wound. Or no. Injury. How are you doing? Uh, yep. The four will get your wound. Uh, where the fuck is this? Oh, injury. There we go. So he has... Uh, <laughs> yeah, so you stabbed him in the guts and then broke his arm. <laughs> so I imagine you, like, impaled him and just, like, smashed him into the ground or something. Uh, <laughs> Draken. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I hit him pretty good. Yeah. He tried to block you. He tried to block his guts with his arm, so you skewed him. Like, <laughs> I mean, I didn't want him crawling away. 
<laughs> All right, and then Moroku, is that it for you? Uh, uh, yes. No wound, no shaking. All right, and then, all right, I think I can just, yeah, he is, he is shaken and stunned and, <laughs> uh, oh yeah, stunned. Yeah. How's this gonna work? Wow. All right. I, I kind of doesn't matter at this point. I'm gonna wrap up the combat because <laughs> unless you guys really want to play through this, <laughs> I think we got it. Yeah. Yeah. I think um, the writing's on the wall here. Yeah. So basically, uh, these two dudes who are running away, you uh, you you see a bunch of like agamids pop out of fucking nowhere with spears and just start like stabbing the shit out of these dudes. Uh, <laughs> so <laughs> they're dead. Um, One less thing to worry about. Yeah, yeah. So basically, yeah. So they're fucking dead, dead. And then what are you doing with this last guy? <laughs> I mean, Jam Roll's next turn was literally just to go finish him. Yep, I'll finish him, and then probably the other guy that's sleeping. All right, <laughs> so you guys see Jamrel with this fucking blood knife out of his hand start fucking... He's very subtle about it. Yeah. <laughs> he stole his actual sword. Huh? <laughs> he has like an actual short sword, now it's just red. Oh, okay. I thought you were... I thought you did the, um... Well, I did the blood blade, but oh, he okay. tries to make it subtle, so it's not obvious that he has like... Oh, okay. <laughs> a fucking lightsaber made out of blood. Okay, okay, you did not do the blood blade. <laughs> oh, I did. Just, he tries to do it subtly. Oh, okay. Know? So, yeah, you guys just see him kind of, like, finishing yeah, off these yeah. two dudes in the bushes. Don't we want to interrogate them or something? <laughs> well, well right. that's what the captain's for. The right. captain's still alive. Yeah. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> Jesus. And then the blood blade goes away. Well... <laughs> Actually, I'm going to wait and see what these Agamids are doing before I put it away. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. With the, uh, there, you guys are in the um, wilderness now. Let's get some wilderness shit going. There we go. <laughs> All right. So, uh, yeah, these three Agamids are slowly approaching down the way. Um. And they see you guys. And and one of them is front out in front. He's like, So I see you helped us out with our little bandit problem. You did. <laughs> no. Come on, Draken. <laughs> hey now, that's racist. <laughs> <laughs> Just, but uh, yeah, we helped you out with your problem. We're hoping you can help us out with ours. Yes, yes. You are the adventurers who have been trespassing on our mountain. Our chief wishes to speak with you. If you'd be so kind, follow us. <laughs> I don't have a problem following. I'm just wondering when we want to question the leader guy. If we want to just bring him with us or... Yeah, let's just try to do that real quick. Chief is, yeah, the chief's probably going to want to talk to him. <laughs> he, can, he can be a pawn in our larger game. Yeah. Nice. I'll try doing a healing check on him. Yeah, he, he made the raise, so he's like, it's not a lethal wound. It basically just fucking knocked him out. Oh, okay. Yeah, so it's. Yeah, like. Um, yeah, so, yeah, and he, the effect, yeah, on a raise, he, the injury goes away, and, yeah, you get an injury. Um, yeah, you only actually die on a critical failure on the Vigor roll. I was just thinking, like, I want to give him a, like, to reduce, like, give, like, soak, like, get rid of one of the wounds. Oh, okay. You want to just, yeah, because he's got four wounds, so you want to get him patched up enough so that he's conscious? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so you could just do a healing check then. Uh, it's minus four though from the. Uh, minus three. The it caps out at three. The penalty. Uh. <laughs> it's like, nope, Drake and fucked him up hard. <laughs> yeah. Um. But yeah, so like he's gonna be out for like twenty four hours at least. 
So we got time. Yeah, mm -hmm. you got time. Um, and yeah, what are you guys doing with this other sleeping bandit? <laughs> the one up here. <laughs> Did yeah. you draw X's over them? <laughs> yeah, it, it, the they can bring it. Yeah, have the elementals bring them down, and then uh, yeah, yeah, and then secure uh, them. You got you got two uh, two offerings. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, he's not dead, so I'll give him the. Uh... Oh, I can't. All right, how do I? There we go. Clear all. I'll give him the the sleeping one as well. How hard would it be to wrap the sleeping guy in my weighted net and just hang it on my pike like a hobo bag? <laughs> Not hard, because he's unconscious. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. <laughs> so you put him in your your net bindle. <laughs> Jesus. Yep. All right. Well, that way, if he wakes up when we're you know busy doing something else, it's at least that he's got to deal with first. No, yep. so. You guys, uh... Yeah. He'll just, like, be carried off seeing all the, all the, um, dragon kid and be like, Wait, oh, I'm fuck. dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it hasn't been ruled out yet, so... Right. It's, it's, they're taking the bodies of the, of everyone. <laughs> That's... Well, <like, laughs> not these ones in particular, but... <laughs> hey, um, that guy looks familiar. I'm pretty sure I killed him an hour ago. Ah, <laughs> uh, so, tastes um, familiar. <laughs> but yeah, so you guys, um, you guys follow the the group of Vagamid warriors along the mountain trail. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's easy enough. They're you know they're going slow, so you city folk can keep up with them. Not that uh, Draken and Katya would have any issues. Um, but yeah, and then, you know, after another half a day's trip or so, um, you arrive at uh, their stronghold in the mountains. And I think we will call today's game here. Cool. Okay. Sounds good. And I'll note that half a day is definitely enough time for your PowerPoints to regenerate. Yeah, yeah, so you guys mm. will get your PowerPoints back and everything. Cool, I'll do that now. Yeah. <laughs> How did you guys like the bandit murder? <laughs> it's good. I love being yeah. ranged, but melee. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I, uh, I helped. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you did. You helped clean up. I that, like <laughs> not being able to act is bad. <laughs> it turns out, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we usually have the other way around. If someone casts haste and then the enemy are all like, wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> oh my god, now they're over here! <laughs> <laughs> oh. That is how we typically like to do things, yeah. 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 I need to get more power points again so I can start casting like haste and shit more often. Yeah. Oh, if you use the add up casting of it you can basically spam it on yourself whenever you want adept isn't a thing in this game i thought you had it i thought you took I, the mechanics. i have versions of it for specific uh backgrounds i think it's only a couple of them that have it uh basically the monk and the um the runologist and the runologist isn't really adept it's they ignore the multi-action penalty if their first action is a um is a spell mm. that's still pretty nice though yeah and then the yeah. um basically the the monk can do their stuff it works almost as adept does if i'm remembering how i wrote it but also we should probably take their crossbows <laughs> Point. We don't have a loot sheet, I noticed. Oh, yeah. I'll have to set that up. Uh, like 10 hand-drawn crossbows at 250 gold each. Like Right. So they're <laughs> they hand-drawn? Because that's what I have. I was hoping to upgrade. Yeah. They're, they're the hand-drawn ones, yeah. All right. That's what I got. Yeah. Well, they're also probably good, you know, 
to add to the armory since we're supposed to be building up a paramilitary force. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, like, we are a we can sell them. organization, so we You're can sell them back to Lady Rose. At a certain <laughs> like, ah, oh, yes, yeah. here's some of the salvage we would like to sell. <laughs> <laughs> While we, just we were want to on help this, the armory, but we need a fee to cover the work. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta, yeah, that seems more than fair. Yeah, I can just I can just imagine her looking at you guys and just being like, "Oh, you." <laughs> I mean, we're kind of the most effective team she has. So I'm so glad yeah. you're joking, so I don't have that. to throw you off a cliff. <laughs> <laughs> You don't want to pay the half cost for these things. Someone else in town will. <laughs> I mean, not if Lady Rose says not to. Yeah. Probably. We can always find buyers. Plenty of people need weapons. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it, and it's not hard to cause a demand for the for the, the need of weapons. <laughs> it is not. <laughs> <laughs> the town next door is having elections instead of just instead of just demi- instead of just appointing somebody. You know what? We need to put an end to this so it doesn't spread. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, mm. you guys. Nope. You guys in your cutthroat business practices. <laughs> Seriously. What is this capitalism? <laughs> Weird. If you don't if you don't care about about the results, you can get anything you want. Yeah. Um. But yeah, hope hope you guys had fun. I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna end the stream. So, thanks for joining us, internet people or person. See you next time. Maybe. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>